And the weather is all good this morning, but some foul weather this afternoon with a chance for some scattered showers and storms. Right now, West Palm Beach waking up to the mid to upper 70s. Dew points already at 73 degrees, so definitely feels pretty muggy out there. Sunrise this morning is around 640. Sunset tonight is around 8 o'clock. Temperatures in Boca in the mid 70s, low 70s in Stewart, and then upper 60s in Fort Pierce. Okeechobee currently at 70 degrees. We're all nice and quiet on the radar this morning, but we will be tracking a cool front making its way down the state today, and that's going to increase our chance for some showers and storms. Here's a look at Vipercast, mainly quiet for the first half of the day. Then as we head into the later part of the day, around 3, 4 o'clock, starting to see those scattered showers and storms bubbling up. Could get a little bit more active as we head into 7, 8 o'clock this evening, 9, 10 o'clock, still tracking some lingering storms, but around mid midnight, most of that rainfall should start to wind down. Any of the those storms that do develop could be on the strong to severe side. You can see we're under the lowest risk for severe weather today, so definitely not a high risk, but the threat is still there. So I advise you to download the WPTV app on there. You not only get those weather alerts, but you can also track the radar live at the palm of your hands, which is also very good if you're out and about and you need to track that rainfall, especially if you're at the beach or anything like that. So here's a look at the hourly planner for today. You can see we'll be in the upper 70s for the first half of the day, mainly quiet, just a few clouds here and there, and then we start to see increasing clouds throughout the day. By around 1, 2 o'clock, some isolated showers and storms, and then scattered showers and storms around 3, 4 o'clock, and that could continue until the evening hours. It's not until later on tonight that we start to see everything fizzle out. That front passes through, and then behind that front, tomorrow going through the weekend, things look a little bit better. Our temperatures will be down to the mid-80s Saturday and Sunday feeling much more comfortable out there with our muggy meter dro dropping to that comfortable category. Dew points down to the 60s for both Saturday and Sunday. So here's what you need to know today. The warmest day with highs in the low 90s, the coolest day Saturday with highs in the mid 80s and our wettest day. Well, that's today with that 60% chance for showers and storms. Again, if you're planning on taking the boat out today, it looks pretty good for the first part of the day. Then things start to get a little active for this afternoon and this evening. Seas running around two to three feet, a light chop in our inland waters and at the beach, a low threat for rip currents, water temperatures in the low 80s. Here's a look at that first alert seven day forecast. Highs today will be into about the low 90s, but feeling like the mid to upper 90s with that humidity by the weekend temperatures down to the mid 80s. Mother's Day looks picture perfect highs around 85 degrees, and then we start to see that heat and humidity return by next week.